So we're gonna spin. And let's see what we get. <coughs> okay, we get um turd. You know, guys, I don't like the turret, but the turrets uh it's a bit good with the farm. I hope I get farm. Okay, this is the most luckiest one. Military base. So this tower spins and so close to S. Mortar. Guys, I love the mortar. I beat it with the solo uh in the solo fall and the a scout if i get a farm it's good anything else oh my God. if it's a freezer imagine it will be margin freezer just just to make it be a little, 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 little paintball a paintballer so guys we're gonna have a bad time We're not gonna go to, so we're gonna have the martial arts. Okay, yeah, guys, I'm gonna tell that. Okay, guys, we're gonna do a molten. I don't expect this one to be, so we're gonna have paintball gear. So we start in the game with paintball. But still, I'm gonna struggle without the farm. So, well, turret is so expensive, that means I can't afford it. So, I'm gonna have to go shoulder pads. I need to upgrade him to level, e, uh, level 3. And he has lead. You have lead detection? Actually, literally the most cheapest tower in the world has lead detection. Um, so guys, when you're in a game, add a uh, paint bowler as your lead attacker. This is the cheapest one. <coughs> it's mildly impressive, but still not impressive enough. We need also military base, but we're not gonna add military base just yet, just yet. So we're gonna wait. Okay, we spawn in. I'm impressive that he can literally yeah. and though this impressive work <laughs> bro my military base is just killing it right now <laughs> bro this this is gonna be hard <laughs> so we're gonna add paint bowlers the more paint boilers to marry. Okay. The military base just spawned in with 60 HP. Why? Well, I'm just gonna add more paint boiler. You're like, bro, there's literally an attack. They will be dealt with with my HUMVs. See? It's gonna be difficult. <coughs> they come just the next round Bruh. but with its impressive feat of completion I can just spam more paint bowlers like I think this is the best impressive move I like this tower but it can't see camo, so it's gonna be a bit hard. But still, I'm gonna spam them. I H U M V's will gonna deal with the hiddens. If I uh, do it correctly, uh, my my face gonna be like this. But still, guys, this is gonna be dangerous because I have only two ta three towers that can see hiddens in this slot. Scout military base and him Third. I had to upgrade him relentlessly <coughs> still guys if you want to defeat lead um lead 
this the paintballers are gonna be good for you because it's lead detection. Uh, Remember, guys, he is uh, impressive. <coughs> guys, we're in wave 21. <laughs> so almost so close to this robot. But I like this impressiveness of the paintballer plus the military base. It's just so impressive then together. Still, we're going to beat it. <laughs> so we just have to wait. We have literally all of these machine gunners except one. Like, why you need money for upgrades if you're in literal in apocalypse? Yeah, but that does that doesn't make sense. It makes sense in balloon C six though. Super sense. So guys, we, guys, we lost with this slot. Still, is mighty impressive for them to reach that. But still, let's continue. Let's go. So what we have first? Commander. Wow. Okay. I'm not a big fan of Commander, but still, it's a great unit. So let us just... With bad slot. And we just place Commander. But we add bo Rocketeer. He's not that a big fan, but Rocketeer is mildly decent. Ranger! Wow! These are so expensive. This is gonna be hard. So, guys, we're gonna lose. We have people. No! Shotgunner! Bro, that's so close to Cowboy. But Shotgunner is gonna be our. In defense. I hate your electroshock. Bro, these are units. The most useless unit in the world. It's not that great, but still. Rocketeer is decent, but they're expensive. And the only main line defense is this or this. But I'm with this. But this has all. This is an four. But that one, okay. So, guys, we need a better map. Okay, guys, we got it. A good map. I'm gonna spawn the shotgun here, reloading. <laughs> This is going to be hard because this one has a big radius of red. It's like I have to spawn him here. He played just few. It's here. Like, what? This is so difficult. This is my lane line defense. Ooh. Guys, I wave 20 already. I kind of like this. It's better. <laughs> you can always one shot most. Even though it's so expensive. Time to place another. I got two level three rocketeers. Not that much, but still decent. But I realized the shock. I spam all of them. I don't think it's not enough. It is enough. I just sacrificed three commanders for that. Just for one, I sacrificed three. Until more spawned, and then I'm like this. This is such an overkill. I can't believe. Like, who do you? Be you. We just have a little point and we're like, mm. Time to spam me. <coughs> Chuck spawned, but it's okay. We have rangers.
we obliterate it, and then we spawn. I skipped, and I instantly spawned another. I tried to we destroy <laughs> because of what? I kind of realized that this is an overkill. I placed in a second ranger, <laughs> skipping it. Mac basics. <laughs> I pressed the first one here. Because I don't like the hidden. I place a shotgun here. Even though it's not connected, uh, oh no. I immediately uh, ask them to fire immediately. Fire! We destroyed it. And I keep spamming. Kind of. And then more spawn. I realized how can I beat the slow bosses in with 31 and here's the solution spam I kind of over spam rangers <laughs> and the next unit I will over spam is rock tier I now realize that Rocketeer is decent. <laughs> Until I realize I don't like these speedy boss. Let me just cut them out of existence. So I did. <laughs> Until I realize that hidden. Just when I destroy it. I instantly press that because I hate it. Until I realize it's literally in our zone. Until we destroyed it. This is entirely fun to play. I place in a commander here for backup purposes until I actually spam. Kidding, I didn't spam, but closely. I realized that this one is a bit close because um, I had to spam. I destroyed, wait, we instantly, they buffed each other, so we literally have, wait, what, bruh, fire, oh, oh no, I realized that this mystery just got out, and then I snipe, I'm not gonna sell him, <coughs> he's a legend. Instead of spamming low, low level rangers, I just use. So much. It's so impressive this loadout. And then we're very set. I skipped. I spawn level three soldiers, not knowing if I can live or survive. The boss spawn. It stunned us, but we have our rangers. I spam shotgunners and sometimes. But still, was it worth it? I continuously sell. I tell really wait, why can't I just do this? Yeah, that's right, the spam. I instantly do that. But I didn't upgrade them to, because I know that that's useless. Until I have another bad look. I place until I really like 10 rangers. So I just sell him. Now.
and I realized I'm gonna win until it there that he's down to win. and then I beat it with this sword. Um, it took a long time.